Boise County's high country has just four feet of snow. That's 51 inches of snow, but that's two feet less than last year. Snow survey crews are taking measurements, trying to figure out how much snowpack will melt into the state's reservoirs and streams, and how much irrigation water farmers will have this season in the valleys below. So overall, what we measured was uh, 51 inches of depth, had a water content of 13.4 inches. Normally up here, we should have about 20 inches of water, so we're only 65% of average at this site. In comparison to last year, we measured 25 inches of water and 74 inches of depth. So we had about 10 inches more water in the snowpack last year than this year. Nine. January snow survey shows current snowpacks in Idaho are anywhere from 45 to 80 percent of average. But the snowpack in the Idaho backcountry now accounts for half the season total. But it's too early to panic. The mountains will continue to collect snow well into May. Uh, right now, I, st I guess I'm still not sweating too much in terms of this year's snowpack because the reservoir is in good shape, the base flows are up, and we have a 70 percent of average snowpack here even 100% in northern Idaho. The highest Idaho snowpacks are 75 to 80% of average in eastern Idaho. The lowest snowpacks just 45%. But with half a season to go, the smart money is on continued snowfall well into May and at least 80% of normal snowpack. For the voice of Idaho Agriculture, I'm Jake Putnam.